Ladies and gentlemen, it is me, Snipeskiller, and I am back playing some more Minecraft today. Yep, that's so funny. How was your guys' Easter and days off from school and best weekend ever? If you're an adult, you only, only got Easter Friday off. That, it's it's kind of sad. But hey, it is what they call Easter Monday today, and I thought I would do a... We'll try to do a triple whammy of videos for you guys here today to make up, uh, make up for the weekend that I missed. And I have big plans for us today. I've just put my pants back on. Big plans for today, guys. So, in the future, I can see comments being a problem and comment storage being a problem. So one thing we're going to have to do at some point is probably make a library to store our comments. Let's check out the tree farm there. Yeah, we'll probably have to make a library to store all our comments. But today, today we are not making a library. And I was going to make a storage room today, but I decided otherwise. And today, guys, uh, gonna need a new diamond pick. Yeah, I'm gonna need some wood and some of that. Um, yeah, I had 30 levels, and I was going to do an enchantment, but I don't have 30 levels anymore. What I do have, though, where did I put them? I had books. Oh yeah, they're all today guys today getting off the track here we are making a commentary room yes we're gonna make a commentary room and I'm gonna sink this in one more block get rid of the sign there we go. so yes we are going to be making a commentary room this is gonna be a 19 by 19 and then 20 by 20 above so it's going to be a pretty big hole inside of our little cave here. But it's going to look pretty nice. I have a good design already done up and I will build a little bit of it. I might build a little bit of it with you guys on camera and off camera just to kind of conserve the boringness out of the videos. But yes, this is where we are going to put it. I should probably get a chest over here with all the materials. First off, I need to build some bookshelves. Some of that. What, just throw out the wood like that? That's kind of rude. Boom, boom. Twelve bookshelves. I don't think that's enough, and I don't really want to put them down too badly. That's another thing we're going to have to make, guys, is an uh, enchanting room. Left, it's pretty good. So let me get the materials that we all need, and I will start the building process. Need quite a bit of stuff, probably all of this stuff. Yeah, okay. So I'll just build a little bit of an entrance for you guys over here. Uh, we have. Wood. You should grab some oak, and it's a good thing to have some waste wood on you, unless you have extra crafting benches. Chess. I will take the chess. Put those down over here, and we'll shove all our materials in. So the entrance, uh, I'm going to dig one more up, let's get rid of these blocks here, the entrance is actually wider than I made this, I think it's like 7 wide, so it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, one more. Crafting bench. Hopefully, 
grab any waste wood. What am I doing? I need wood that I can make sticks with and all that. Sticks, that, and that. Unless I threw it in the chest and I'm not remembering putting it there. Yes, uh, more sticks. I'm guessing sticks in the middle and then on the sides. This will be our middle for the three wide, so I'll take that out. And then we have birch. Uh, the phone's ringing. That's kind of weird. Phone, stop interrupting. I'm busy. I'm sure it's not important. They can wait. Okay guys, sorry for that little cut there, I just had to go and see what that little message on my machine was about. So I need lots of planks, we're going to take 16 of that, a nice stack of planks. So what we have here is we have some birch um, fences, that's what I mean to say, and then we have some spruce, on, or uh, not spruce, dark oak wood, so I like dark oak wood a lot better than spruce. And we're still tying in with the general theme of our cave. We go like this. Like this. And then behind these birch we have up, over, and then up. And then we have to cap it off with that. And then we go up here. I did more of dark oak above. Go like this. And we go up over and then up. Cap it off again. And again, I think we have the stair. So let us go up yet again. Sort of messing around. I don't have the design fully in my head, but I do have an idea of what it looks like. Uh, yeah, let's put wood across here. Let's put that. One, two, three. Oh, I went too far back with this. I was wondering why that kind of looked a little weird. So up, over. So yeah, this is a little bit of what our entrance is going to look like. Uh, I'm going to have to dig out more of the roof because I want to be able to get a good view of this thing when we're walking up to it to start our commentaries or to start a reading. Uh, we're going to be doing glowstone lighting in here instead of torches just because I think it'll look a little bit better and it's going to really add to the design. It's kind of what I had in mind too, so that we get a good look of it. And oh boy, I have a lot of digging. Lots of digging ahead. Yeah, this can get really boring for you guys, so I'm going to just cut here. I'm going to dig this entire thing out just to make it easier on the both of us, I guess. 
Well, these are on you guys, because you guys do not want to see me dig out this entire place. I think I will dig out the 19 by 19 circle, and we will get back to decorating. based on a seven wide circle on each end. So in between this block and the next, at the back is seven, I believe. This is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yes, so this is seven wide. And I really need to make some more torches because it's dark in here. I prefer no creepers in here, if at all possible. this area which goes two and we take out this and we go two and behind that it should be one two three one two three yep so that is the basic design for our little circle thingy here the unperfect unsymmetrical circle I really think you guys are going to like this room, because I know that I really like it. It's a really good design by me, which is kind of weird, because I usually don't design the best things. I'm not the best interior decorator kind of guy. Uh, I will take that torch and put it where it is needed, over here. So this is our pretty much dead center, I believe. Yeah, this should be dead center right here. So, dead center, I have a... This big of an area. Right there, Dad, you're close. This, this is dead center. One more. So, dig down. supposed to be three by three. Uh, I'm not sure. It seems too big. It seems way too big. 
Alright, give me one second, guys. I'm going to go try and copy down a little bit more of our design. Alright, guys. So, standing dead center, you get a 3x3 three three area. If I could get some light up in here. You get a 3x3 three three area, and then an extra area for stairs. So, that only leads up to there. just as a guideline. This wood is not final, not permanent. Man, it is really going out there. So this is our dead center area. And I'm going to put extra design. This build calls for a lot of spruce. Why do I keep saying spruce? I'm always saying the spruce. Uh, a lot of birch, a lot of dark oak. So it's got a lot of cobble and iron and gravel and useless stuff in my inventory. See guys, this is when I need like a modded fixer doohicker thing. Am I saying fixer doohicker? Yeah, no, that doesn't doesn't make sense. That. This is when you need like the regrowth series, too many items where you have the sorting. And, okay. So, getting off track here, going into a series that doesn't exist in this series. So, we go one, two, like this. Up at the front, we have some stairs and we have two planks. We're gonna need a lot of birch stairs because all around the outside is birch stairs. Mine through here. Uh, let's just get some birch. Cut this, cut that, cut that, and cut that. So, this is the general design. So this is the general kind of design I came up with. It's just the little rough, the rest, the finished product is going to look a lot better than just this. It's going to be quite higher, it's going to have nice decorative things on it. It's going to look really nice. I could probably leave all this. dead center. Uh, what next? What next? So this is not the finished front design I was going for. We need that up there. That is the finished front design I was going for. Yes. Pop a torch up there. Hmm, where to go next? I think I should add in these support beams I have. I'm pretty sure I have one. I'll put in a very specific layout for, I think, a specific reason. Either that or this is just the way I wanted it to be. Like this, and like this. Here. But yes, they are all laid out just for this. I think I might have one too many. I don't know, that looks good. So, yeah, yep, that's right, alright. Always second guessing myself, that's it's not a bad quality, but it's not a good quality. Go with what your heart says, people. Take 
this out. Um, I'm gonna make all these birch stairs that I need. So I'm gonna take all of this, do some stairs. That is not a lot. Uh, I think I can spare another stack on stairs. 64, not bad. I'm not gonna get us all the way around, but it, it's a starting point. Turnings. I am going to dig this out, and I will be right back. Okay guys, so I just had to take a quick little break there to just do a couple things. Uh, hasn't been very long, so memories are still fresh in my head. And this is what we have. The stairs actually made it all the way around. And some, because we had to put some stairs up here in the middle, which is nice. So now, the next part of the build is to fill in these areas. Now I have them just pretty much nice and plain. Pretty sure it is just all dark oak. At least that is what I am guessing. I will go back and check. Check. I'll go back and check it to make sure in a few seconds or so because the power of video editing and such I do not want to waste more wood and I am back okay so it is partially right in the fact that it is mostly all of the dark oak not spruce dark oak and then we actually short two stairs, which kind of sucks. I was hoping not to waste more birch, but unfortunately we have to for these corners. And then we need dark oak stairs, not spruce. Um, man, I'm getting the lags. Uh, I only need actually the perfect number. Good, so I didn't waste any more wood there. And now, going diagonal, uh, that block stays, I believe. Um, yeah, we'll keep that block for now. Obviously, I'm trying to do this off of the top of my head. I don't know if it's working too, too well, but at least getting the build nice and done. I try not to keep this episode short or too long, because I'd rather not have a very short episode, I'd rather not have a very long episode, because if I'm going to be making or trying to do the triple whammy of videos today, then I'm going to try and not get too big of upload times, because the pretty sure like the maximum amount of time I've ever gone for a video was, I don't know, like 50 minutes. I think that's like the max I've ever done. And the one time I uploaded a 50 minute video, it took, uh, how long did it take exactly? Uh, I'm gonna replace this with some dark oak. upload I think I've ever done is 50 minutes and to do that it took what like 240 minutes so that's about what like four or five hours for one upload that was not fun could just be because of my internet it could be for other reasons I have no idea all I know is it took a long long time and I would try or I'm going to try and not to ever have that happen again. Um, okay, so next. Pretty sure I did not use birch here. I did use birch slabs, though, if I am not mistaken. So let's get some slabs. 
again, I will have to go and check the design because I'm not 100% sure. I'm just going back and forth between worlds trying to get the design implemented into this world. But I think we are going pretty well. We're going very, very well. And yes. So I probably have to dig out a little bit of the roof. kind of want to make this build seem and feel larger because it is quite a big build in the other world. It's got like a nice dome roof on top. I'm supposed to destroy that block. That's okay. So I will dig out. I will dig out some of the roof, and then I will be right back. I know there's a lot of cuts in this video, but it's gotta be done. I dig that out. All right. So I will be right back. Hey guys, welcome back to the let's play of the Minecraft and. Hasn't been very long yet again, and I just copied in our nice little, a nice little chair design in here that I put on my other build. And one thing that I do need to grab is bricks. I do need bricks, and I also need. I don't. I don't have very many flowers. It's kind of. Kind of sucks. I don't have a lot of flowers. I do have trees over at the tree farm. I should probably harvest my crops and get some food because I have no food on me at all right now and all my foods should be grown. Yeah, they're pretty much all already grown. Lots of lag. The tree grew, which is nice. Uh, I'm going to take a few of that, not so many. I'm surprised that chicken just didn't get one shot by Ranger Danger Close. That's that's a pretty tough chicken right there. He may have deserved to live. Maybe he was a worthy opponent for Danger Close. Ranger Danger Close. But yes, I don't know if you guys know what I'm doing with these, but now you should know what I'm doing with these. Flower pots, yes. Why did I only get three? That's what I don't get. Unless I only had three on one side. And it's like, nope, you can't make any more. Go like this. This just adds some natural ish decoration to the build, make it look a little better. Just go random, random amount of different types of flowers and such. So yes, it is coming along very well now. Uh, we have to still do a little bit more work here. Uh, I have to get, I can't pick up anything, which is actually kind of nice. Maybe go like this, no chicken. Yes, we still have a little bit of work to do here, um, along the edges, which is what I'm digging out here, I put spruce, why do I keep always saying spruce? We have to put dark oak wood along the top, sort of like a cap layer, I'm getting block lag. like a kind of cap thing. Uh, I'm not exactly sure how it completely goes. I'm pretty sure it follows the pattern of the bottom. But I will just go with it. I'm just gonna roll with it. And I'm pretty sure it goes here and here. Um, sure it follows the same pattern. So if you guys, yet again, sorry for this, 
but if you will give me just a moment to get this done, I could probably skip using a block back there, but no. Uh, oh, I didn't do that, did I? Or did I? Yeah, I think I did. So we'll just do it like that. No, never mind. I'm not going to cut it here. Just kidding, guys. April Fools. Ha ha ha. Joke's on me, I guess. But I'm not going to cut it there. I'm going to build with my fellow viewers slash subscribers slash YouTube peeps. Uh, there might be a skeleton around here, which is not a good thing. No, skelly, no. Go away. actually looks like the way I did it, which is probably why I didn't have to cut. Yes, this looks exactly like the way I did it. It's already starting to turn out like what I've envisioned and what I've envisioned and built already for you guys as the amazing subscribers. Yes. Okay, yes, this is looking amazing. Yeah, I'm going to take a step back and we're just going to marvel in the work that we've done so far. Heck, in like an hour, actually not even an hour, like half an hour, I got all this pretty much done, which is nice. It's kind of an amazing feat for me, I guess you could say. Because usually, I think the builds I do usually take like, what, 30, 30 minutes to build? And that's usually on camera. Like, heck, our giant sugarcane field took what? Uh, gotta say that took about 17 minutes to build. For about a 3 minute time lapse, which is pretty nice. This video will probably have a time lapse too. Not entirely sure. Probably will though, just because. Just because this build is a part of our cave and it does follow the same style, we need to put slabs leading to it. So, I have slabs, which is nice. So, we're going to go... Ooh, there is... There's the lighting visual glitches. And, get a few more. Oh my god, I missed... I missed the workbench, I missed click. Missed clicked. stair here, maybe. What is that going to look like? Is it going to... No, it's not going to connect. Yeah, that actually looks pretty good. Sweet. So there we are. We have most of it done. Uh, still waiting on quite a lot of things. That I should probably... Well, I will change the roof out. I'm not sure if I'm going to go with the roof that I used for my other... for the other build. I might just show you guys what the final product looks like. It's actually quite nice. Um, made some of these for the other side here, and here, and here, and here. None up here though. So I think I might tap into our string farm, but I'm going to dump off a lot of the stuff here that I do not need. I take all the junk out of this chest that I just want to throw away forever. I'll throw my axe in there and the sign and the bricks and take the rest. Uh, actually, never mind. I'll keep my axe on me and throw in that. And the trees. And yes, okay. So 33 iron and we only dug out a little hole. That's actually pretty good. Uh, I got 41 more to smelt only have 11 diamonds, guys. Uh, it kind of sucks. It's kind of terrible. But nonetheless, it is still diamonds. Uh, I have 17 ink sacks. Uh, so let's... Um, I'm going to 
gonna take a little, a little small little break here, I guess. Uh, I gotta dig a hole just to throw this trash in. Too much cobble. Heck, I think a double chest full is full enough. This stuff will be spawned in a nice little five minutes. I'm gonna keep that iron sword. I don't know what for, but I will keep it. I just need a piece of cobble. Cap that off so I don't step on it and pick all that crap up. Um, throw the birch in there, throw that in there, and that in there. And yes. Okay, so I'm gonna go take a small little break here yet again. I'm gonna do a little bit of farming just to get some food up because I hate walking slow in this game. And yet again, guys, sorry for all the cuts, but I will be right back. Hey. Hey, hey, you. What you looking at? What are you looking at? Can't you see I'm just walking here? I, I'm just trying to, trying to, trying to move along here. Look at that spider spin. Spin, 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 spin. Alright, so. Tapped a little bit into my string farm. I'm pretty sure this is how you carpet it is not I just saw it it's only two okay nice so nine should do us for now oh, I'm sorry I have to use the inks can I die that I cannot die that how many wool can I die with that not gonna use all of it probably not even that much black carpet. I did not need white carpet. That was a mistake. Ugh, mistakes. They are the worst. So, guys, these are our little side tables here made with the finest black wool around. Right from Snipes Killer's own string farm. And there we go. We have some tabletops now. So that is why I had to tap into my wool reserve. But yes, this room, oh my god, it looks amazing. The one thing we are missing, though, is... Da -da -da -da. No chicken. Okay. So one thing we are missing in here is some cyan clay. So I'm going to do a little spin, and I'm going to cut, not twitch. Ooh, look at that face. Wow. Did it really revert me because it was like broken? But yes, I'm going to do a little bit of more work. Actually, how do you even make hardened clay? I'm pretty sure I have some extra clay around here. I'm pretty sure you make some clay and then you fire that clay in that. And I think that's how you get the hardened clay. But the better thing to do would be find a mesa biome, because cyan clay, I'm not sure if it naturally spawns in mesa. I'm not sure if it naturally spawns in mesa, but we are still going to need to find a mesa biome. Either way, I'm just going to do a little digging, and hopefully we can find a mesa biome. Maybe not to this episode, but maybe the next. And I think I'm pretty getting getting pretty close to the time I'm looking for on this video, but yes, we have a nice little built area here. It's coming along, not quite finished. All the lighting isn't in place and such. But yes, guys, we'll move on to the comment of the day, and we will call the episode there. Alright, guys, so I have the comment of the day nicely picked out here for you guys, and the whole reason whole reason why we've been building this room is just for this purpose. Take a, take a nice little seat on the couch here, read you guys a book, and here we are. So, hey Snipes, I know you have your vanilla Minecraft Let's Play, but will you be doing a modded Minecraft series as well? Signed me, yet again. You guys need to leave more comments. You guys need to leave question things so I can answer them for you. Yeah, you need to do that. Um... Yeah, I know I have my vanilla Minecraft series, but modern Minecraft 
definitely in the future. Definitely, definitely, definitely. I will definitely be doing my mod in Minecraft. Um, I might build my own pack. I'm not exactly sure. There's a lot of mods I'd like to have in that pack, though. Like Buildcraft, um, Thomcraft, definitely Applied Energistics, Archimedes Ships, definitely one. Probably Pam's Harvest, just so we get like extra food and all that. Um, what's another one? Tinker's Construct, definitely Tinker's Construct. Um, not sure what other good mods are out there. Definitely gonna have to take a look. I definitely want the one where you get the machines that work on RF. I'm not sure what mod that is, but I definitely want that mod in my mod pack because that that will be a nice little mod, I guess. I need to say, yeah. So that'll be a nice mod to put in there, and yes. But definitely to answer your question, definitely be doing a modded Minecraft series in the future. Guys, I think that wraps up the episode. I'm pretty sure this was episode 9. Yep, episode 9. So as you can already see, we're already taking up a little bit of the chest with our things. So this the, just reinforces the fact that we are going to need to build a place to store all the comments one day. Because, heck, I hope to be doing this for quite a while. And with your guys' support, I will be doing this for quite a while. And hopefully bringing you guys some good, high-quality, action-packed, maybe, videos. But yep, guys, this has been Snipeskilla here. Leave a like, comment, subscribe below to support me and my channel in the stuff that I'm doing here, which is Minecraft and other things that I will be doing soon. But thank you guys for watching very, very much, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.